So the question on everybody's lips, what about the hosepipe ban? Uh, please don't worry, I've been in touch with Southern Water. I'm a Southern Water customer, not a South East Water customer. And in this area at the moment, there's no hosepipe ban planned for the near future. So I've been assured I'm okay to carry on until the end of this challenge, the 31st of August, which is terrific news. Um, it does though give an opportunity to talk about water responsibility and water usage and uh, saving water and those that have been following this challenge will know that um, showering outside is great for uh, water responsibility not only diverting water away from the drainage and sewer system but also saving water because one tends to be a bit qu quicker when the water is cold and also when it's on a trigger um, I stop to lather down so I'm saving quite a lot of water over 10,000 litres of water saved in the year and between 10 and 14,000 litres of water diverted away from the drainage and sewer network. So showering outside on the grass added benefits that I get to water bits of the grass each day, um, added benefits of showering outside with cold water from the hose. So give it a go, you'll be surprised. Good morning, it's Wednesday the 3rd of August and that takes me through to day number 337. That's 337 of 365 of me taking my morning shower outside in the garden or wherever I am with cold water from the hose every day for a whole year, no matter what the weather. And this is all to try to raise some money for the RNLI, is to try and raise awareness of water safety and drowning prevention. And also to try to encourage responsible use of the drainage and sewer network. Today I'm in a different location, I'm here at Little Hampton Lifeboat Station so I get to tick another lifeboat station off the list. I'm going to have a quick look around. So there's the station, a B class and a D class in the shed. And a quick look around. Quite a nice location for a shower actually, Little Hampton. the water is from the hose at Little Hampton. Um, no birthdays to mention today so let's crack straight into shower number 337. Here goes. It goes on YouTube. It's my it's a fundraising challenge every day for a whole year, no matter where I am. So my shower outside, cold water, raise money for the R and LI. So look me up on YouTube, Guy Addington. Guy Addington, yeah, on YouTube. Uh, well, I'm from Margate. I'm just working here today. <laughs> Morning. Um, okay. So, I mean that's that's fine, but they uh, they belong to the local authority, to the council. Oh, do they? Yeah, so they're administered by them. Um, I mean, your best bet is do you, where's the? I'm not from Littlehampton. I'm from Margate. Um, where's the council office? I would. I would probably, that's the best place to drop it because they belong to the local authority. Yeah. Oh, I mean, well, well done for picking it up. Um, but um, yeah, it's, it's, a constant, it's a constant problem, public rescue equipment being vandalised. Um, so like massive well done for picking it up. Um, but they'll probably have a log as to where one is missing. Oh, okay. We don't, we don't look after them. Out, yeah? yeah, and they should sort it out, okay, yeah. Mate, take it down um, I mean, leave it here, but I'm, I don't, I'm, I'm not based here. No, that's um, all right. Like, like I say, if they, if they don't want to deal with it, they'll probably get sent somewhere Yeah, that's, that's, that's your best bet. Yeah. Okay, um, mate, no worries. If you get any, if you get any problems, um, come, come back. Okay, uh, I'll be here until about lunchtime. And okay, I'll, mate, we'll do. If, if there's any, if there's no one there or you have any problems, come back and then I'll contact them for you. That's lovely. Thanks, mate. Cheers. No worries. All the best. Yeah. Morning. 
I'm, um, it's a year long challenge to take my morning shower outside with cold water from the hose every day for a year. Where no matter where I am, so I'm working away. Let me up on YouTube and I've got a just giving link, it's fundraising for the RNLI. 337. So nearly finished. Yeah. <laughs> I, I've been taking a little longer, I've got some uh, people to talk to. <laughs> I'll be with you in a minute. I'll, I can't get used to it. <laughs> works and help me get maybe just a few more donations that would be amazing thank you so much um, everybody have an amazing day and a massive thank you to Little Hampton Lifeboat Station for the use of the hose and the water um, really helpful and some of the residents at Little Hampton <laughs> um, all the best I'll see you again tomorrow bye bye for now